Are you ready for calendar time? Good! Then sing with me! Sunday, Monday, what comes next? Tuesday, Wednesday, you know the rest. Thursday and Friday is nearly the end until Saturday. Start of the weekend. Yeah! In January and February, we're starting the year. March and April, spring is here. July and August We're soaking up the sun Autumn breeze in September And October too November, remember thankfulness And December The year is through It's calendar time Today is Monday, July 26th 2021. Do you know what yesterday was? The day before today. Yesterday was Sunday, July 25th, 2021. What about tomorrow? What will tomorrow be? The day after today. Tomorrow will be Tuesday, July 27th, 2021. Tomorrow is someone's birthday. Tomorrow is Axel's birthday. Axel lives in Michigan. Let's sing to Axel. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Axel. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Axel. I hope you have a wonderful birthday tomorrow. Today's number is the number 26. It's the 26th day of July. Let's count down from 26 together. 26, 25, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one. Let's count up from 26 together. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31. Are you ready to add to our number 26? Let's draw a number. I drew the number four. What's four? plus 26. Let's count up. 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. 26 plus 4 is 30. Let's do another addition problem with our number 26. Let's add 20 to our number 26. When we add tens, we go down on the hundreds chart. So let's use our hundreds chart. How many tens do we have in 20? Two tens, 10, 20. Two tens, so we go down twice. Let's start at 26. 36, 46. We went down twice. 26 plus 20 is 46. Great job adding with me. Now let's make some change. Can we make 26 with the coins we have here? Let's start by using dimes. Dimes are worth 10 cents. 10, 20, 
30. <gasps> That's too much. Let's put a dime back. 20 cents. Could we use a nickel next? Five cents? We could. 20 and five makes 25 cents. Now we just need to use a penny worth one. 25, 26. We could use even less coins though. Our two dimes and one nickel made 25. But we have a coin that's worth 25 all by itself. It's called a quarter. Let's use a quarter. 25. Now we just need one penny. 26. Two dimes, one nickel and a penny, and one quarter and a penny. Two ways to make 26 cents. What's the weather like where you are? We're having a rainy day. Rain is important to help the plants grow. Let's put rainy on our calendar time weather bar graph. The bar is going a little higher above rainy. How many rainy days of calendar time have we had so far in June, July, and August? That's right, we've had three rainy days so far. We know because the bar is going up to the third line. Time to add to our doodle bug. 97 days that we've had calendar time. Let's count by ones. Count with me. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty, thirty one, thirty two, thirty three, thirty four, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97. Let's count by fives. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. Let's count by eights. Eight, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, 56, 64, 72, 80, 
88, 96. Let's count by tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Let's count by 25s. 25, 50, 75. It's time to add another straw. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine groups of ten straws, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven groups of one straws, nine tens, seven ones, 97 straws for 97 days that we've had calendar time. What happened today in history? Let's take a look. Do you know who this is? This is Benjamin Franklin. On July 26, 1775, the Congress appointed Benjamin Franklin the first Postmaster General of the organization known as the United States Postal Service. He was responsible for all post offices from Massachusetts to Georgia, and he had authority to hire as many postmasters as he saw fit. Our current Postmaster General is Louis DeJoy, He's the 75th person to hold that position and is responsible for managing and directing the day-to-day -day operations of the United States Postal Service. The Postmaster General has a lot of responsibility, a lot of duties that are important and decisions that need to be made. The Postmaster General is the one in charge of making sure all of us get our mail in our mailboxes and the mail we send out gets to the right mailboxes. That's a lot of responsibility. Do you have any responsibilities? Jobs that you're in charge of doing? I know that sending mail all over the United States with so many post office boxes and post offices and so much mail is a lot to manage and handle. You might have a job that's a lot to manage and handle too. How do you organize it? How do you make sure it gets done well? How do you make your decisions for your responsibilities? I hope that today, Monday, July 26, 2021, you can do your responsibilities well. Go check the calendar and you can say.